Hey kids, Ham and Cheese back here with you today. And I just want to talk about a common problem that a lot of people are experiencing with the Yaesu FTM 300, but doesn't appear to be very well documented. Now, this is a new one I just put in. I only had this in here a couple days. And one of the problems I was experiencing is if you go to transmit a beacon here, you get a transmit prohibit message. Now, what I found out was the reason this is occurring is because of this screen status bar right here. That status bar is indicating that the radio is receiving information. But it's not, and it thinks it is, because the squelch is open. If you take the squelch and you turn it to just even one, the green bar disappears. And now the radio is no longer receiving the white noise of the open squelch. And then when you go to transmit, the issue is corrected. Now, the thing with this is, like I said, it's a common problem, but it's not very well documented. It took me several days to find the answer to this. And so I decided to do a quick little video on it. And here's the reason why a lot of people have the problem. In this radio, there is an option under APRS, option 5, to mute it. If you turn that on, as you can see, it's off now. If you turn that on, all sounds and all white noise from the APRS beacons go away. So you don't know that you're hearing the white noise, and the radio thinks it's receiving... And that's the reason why you get that transmit prohibit message. Hopefully that helps some of you out that are looking for the same fix. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.